Hi, today I'm going to show you how to make little mini gingerbread houses. Now these, um, I've just stuck that on top now. I'll put it off just so you can see. These just can go on the tops of glasses. So with little name tags in them, they'd be so cute to have on the tables for Christmas Day. Alternatively, um, really good teacher thank you Christmas present. You can package them up with a little mug, with a little mug like that, and um, package it up with some nice tea or coffee and put it all in some cellophane. And yeah, it makes a really good um, Christmas present. But yeah, I think I think I'm going to put them for on the champagne glasses for Christmas Day, which I'm very excited about now. I got this Good Taste magazine and it comes with, um, you can see I didn't even decorate mine. I couldn't find my icing pen. I can't be bothered making royal icing, but I'm sure you can, you know, decorate it nicely yourselves. But I just wanted to, you know, show you how to attach it. It's, it's really simple to do. I almost feel a bit ridiculous making a tutorial for it. Um, but I'll put the link to the template. It's so easy. There's, you know, little tiny pieces, three pieces, cut it out. I used an icing pen to stick it together because I couldn't be bothered making royal icing. Super easy and I just reckon these look so cute. So you could even make all the pieces, freeze them, put them in the freezer and then just, the, you know, a day or two days before, glue them all together and put them in the fridge to harden and have them all ready to go for Christmas Day. Okay, so I've got all my pieces. Um, I'm now going to use some sort of support structures and I'm going to glue them together. Just got bought this writing icing. Usually I'd get some royal icing, but I couldn't be bothered making it. So I just bought this and um, hopefully it will stick together. First step, I've got my two pieces here. I'm going to move this one across once I've got it. This is my little tiny piece. So I um, put icing on either side. So that's the first point. So I had the wrong sides. <laughs> so I've just redone it. Okay, so I've stuck the two sides on. I am just going to stick this uh, end on and use my other um, bottle of sun cream to hold it together. Okay, so I've just iced um, the top of it and I'm just going to put the roof on and then put my supports next to it to, so it can dry in place. Okay, I'm going to let that dry and then um, I'll decorate the top later. Okay, so I'm going to make a little flag sort of name label at the top. I've literally just printed out my name. Um, that font was a freebie, Jenna Sue is the name of it. Now, you basically want to cut out around the name, but also add like a rectangle the same size because um, you're going to wrap it around. So, show you what I mean. Okay, so you end up like, can you see that? Like that. Okay, very simple. Grab some toothpicks. You just want to wrap it around. So it's like that. I'll probably put it at the top. Yep, and then I'm just going to get some sticky tape and wrap it the whole way around. Okay, so I've just stuck my little thing um, in the house like that. I mean, you don't have to have these labels, but I reckon it's pretty cool just to have. So, you know, everyone's got, you know, instead of having name tags for your table setting for Christmas Day, you've got a little gingerbread house on the cup with your name on it. So you can do better labels than what I've done. Mine is just so basic just for the purposes of this tutorial. Um, yeah, I'm sure you can do much better than that. But anyway, I hope it gives you um, some ideas for something to do for Christmas.